mean, uh, just know that denominators can't be zero because, and this is kind of a trick question, so I expect most of you guys to get this wrong. If I took 5 and divided it by 0, um, what is that? Undefined. It's undefined, right? So that's good. You got it right. The question is, why is it undefined? Well, if we were to do long division, right? How many zeros go into 5? A lot more than that. It's infinite. So you can, you can have as many zeros that go into 5 as you want, and, well, you could still have more. So it's infinite, which is why it's undefined, which is why we don't include it in the domain if the denominator equals 0. So let's look at some examples. On this one, we're looking, <coughs> let's do both of these. We'll do one at a time. On this one, we want to find the domain, right? So what values of x, in other words, work? Well, we just know that this denominator can be 0. So in other words, x minus 4, it just can't equal, oh man, 0. So how would I solve this non-equation? Add 4 to both sides, right? So I would get x does not equal 4, and as a domain... I want to say they want it like this in set builder notation. So x, oh, let me, let me take back that in. x doesn't equal 4 and x, this is the worst, is all, and I ran out of space, real. Numbers is a big, big word, so I'm, oh man, those are bad fancy brackets. There we go. This one will find the domain the same way. So if we can make this denominator equal to 0, we can ignore the rest of this garbage for now. All right. So if I wanted to solve this one, I would add 18 to both sides. So I get 18 equals negative 7x. And then I would divide both sides by negative 7. What am I doing? See what happens when you do too much math, man? It's a marathon. Let's subtract that. Oh, that, that'll make it very nice. That'll make it 18 sevenths positive. But that's what x can't be. I should have put that in there. I apologize. So x can't be 18 sevenths. This one wanted this in interval notation. So how do we exclude negative, uh, 18 sevenths, rather, positive? Well... We know that it includes all the negative values. It's going to stop at 18 sevenths, which is not included. Then we'll unite this, not including 18 sevenths, going to infinity.